Welcome to the Q On Demand podcast, your source for expert tips from the authors of the Q On Demand series. For more information on the topics covered in this podcast series and for bonus online content, visit QOnDemand.com forward slash podcast, home of the visual, color, step-by-step reference guides for all your CS4 learning and more. Hi, I'm Steve Johnson, and welcome to another edition of Q On Demand podcast. Today we're going to be talking about the separations pane in Illustrator CS4. You've worked on this document, and it's a color document, and you're going to be sending it off to a commercial printer. And you're really excited about it, you spent a lot of time with it, but now you want to make sure that it's exactly right. So you want to be able to test out the separations in color. When you send a document to a commercial printer, they separate the document into colors, uh, CMYK, uh, which stands for Siam, Yellow, Magenta, and Black. And what they do is they print out each one of the different colors on a different plate. And so in Illustrator CS4, you want to be able to check to make sure the colors uh, are correct and they look the way you want them to. So let's go ahead and we're going to go ahead and open up the separations preview panel and with that you can go ahead and display in this case all the CMY colors and you'll notice you'll see them right here. We're going to go ahead and select the overprint preview option in the pane and that allows you to be able to see all the different colors that are in your document. Now you'll notice that there are uh, it's called the visual icons that looks like an eye and you can go ahead and you can turn off and on different colors within your document to be able to see exactly how it looks for each one. So if I take out the black in this case, you can kind of see how your document is going to be able to look. And you can take out, in this case, yellow, magenta, okay? And then you can go ahead and click on them to bring them back in. So you can actually see what it looks like. Now the important thing here is when you have overlapping objects with different colors in your document. And so here it allows you to be able to see how those um, objects look and you, you'll notice that if there's any overlapping, if there's any color trapping uh, that might need to take place. And trapping basically is when two objects overlap slightly. So when they're printed in, through a commercial printer and things get adjusted a little bit during the printing process, that those colors will still look good and there won't be any gaps in between them. So the separations preview pane allows you to be able to see those and separate the colors so you can see individual ob objects and how the color displays on your, in your document. So it is an important thing and it's something you should check before you send out any document to a commercial printer. For more information and bonus online content, visit QOnDemand.com forward slash podcast, home of the visual, color, step-by-step -step reference guides for all your CS4 learning and lots more. QOnDemand.com forward slash podcast.